Hey guys, how you doing? Chris Tran for Arms Collective. Today for a short video clip, we are going to talk about North Tech Defense firearms. Um, I have a North Tech Defense for the lower uh, that I've got mounted on my Faxon Firearms ARAC 21. Uh, so I was really excited today to actually finally get a chance to pick up one of their really nice billet uppers. It's 7075 T6 Aerospace Grade Aluminum. Um, the cool thing about these, other than just the fact that it's absolutely stylish, uh, CNC machine beautifully fit and finish is gorgeous on it. Uh, is that it has this really nice blingy uh, little tie fang as they call it. It's their uh, titanium forward assist. Uh, just a gorgeous piece of machinery. Uh, it comes exactly as it looks right here uh, with a pre-installed ejection port cover. Uh, so you don't have to worry about uh, messing around with an upper parts kit uh, to get this put together. So we're going to be kind of tracking my progress on a build uh, based around North Tech Defense. So I'm really excited for this. So happy to finally get my hands on one of these uppers. Can't wait to build it out. Uh, the trigger component that I'm going to be using for this one, um, which I also just got my hands on today, which I'm really happy about, is the new trigger pack from CMC Triggers. I'm really looking forward to this. I've heard great things about it. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to swap this out with uh, the current trigger pack that I've got in my North Tech Lower, which is uh, Rock River Arms uh, two-stage, which is perfectly fine. There's nothing wrong with it. I love it. I've had it for years, but I want to put this one in and see what this can do. Uh, the cool thing about this one, other than the fact that it's obviously a, a straight drop-in, is that CMC Triggers has done um, a, a pretty a, a pretty good job um, in terms of responding to customer feedback, is that not only they come with the trigger pack now, but they've also added uh, their own version of kind of like these anti-walk pins. Um, um, as you can see uh, through the pinholes here, you know, there's the possibility that, that your trigger pins uh, might pop through. Uh, so what they've done is that uh, complete with each kit now, they've actually added their own set of anti-walk pins uh, to, go along with, uh, to go along with your trigger group assembly, which is just a really nice touch. Uh, very responsive to uh, the customer's questions, the customer's feedback, which I think was a really good move on their part. So stay tuned. Uh, we'll keep on showing you the build as the build progresses. Again, Chris Tran for Arms Collective. Have a good one. Thanks for tuning in.